yeah, we will keep the old one. And into the first slot here, we'll apply again standard material and check out the wire. Now we will also change the color. And before we do anything else, we go to render setup, change the resolution to something bigger. I will lock this. And also the renderer should be mental ray. Now, if I change to mental ray, you will also see that this texture changed. So cool. So if you are texture of the bottom, it will be simple white material with uh, edges. Now let's go here. Now this will be metal one or yeah. Let's call this metal top. And from this we will do the rest. Now let's change this to Archan Design. I will not uh, do the metal from ray trace material like I do usually, but from this one here. I will keep like this so far. I will change this to metal material and change this reflection to Fresnel. I will also increase this to 50. Now you see the reflections are cool. And also this glossiness to 07. Now the reflection should be a little bit blurred, so I will put here more samples. And actually, that's all. I will just put here my texture of metal gold. This should be the one. Why not? And actually, I'm ready to go. But uh, as I told before, uh, the top will be divided into silver and gold. Let's call the material silver and gold. Now. Uh, so I will not put here just a bitmap, but mix. Now it's because uh, uh, I need to merge uh, the silver texture with my, uh, gold texture. So I told in the middle should be silver. So I will go here and put here now the bitmap. Metal one, metal gold, and now the mask which I did. So this one. And now <coughs> the material should be divided by this mask. So cool. <coughs> Sorry. And the last thing which I will do, I will apply the bump. So I will go here, bitmap again, and this should be the top. So we'll put here the top one. And we will see later uh, how it will be looking on the model. So maybe we should increase the it a little bit later, but we'll see. So I will Turn this on to see the texture in the view. You can try, I don't know, you can put it here and see. Now, I'm not sure if it's going away from the model or inside. It's hard to say. Let's increase this to see. Yeah. Okay, let's try it different. Okay, now I think it's going inside. So I will put here a positive number. And this should be fine. So we have here the top. And we will see later how we'll be looking with the bump map. Now I will copy this. Rename it to metal bottom. Now we'll just bottom and change the bump map to back. And also I will copy this and rename it to metal side. I will turn off the bump map and also I will clear this one and put here just the gold map. So with all settings equal, you can play with the glossiness here, with the index of refraction, it's up to you. Now applying to the model, very easy. Let's go to standard, change this to multi sub object. Uh, <coughs> we have uh, three materials, so I will discard everything. I will quickly make here a checker, checker map. Cool. And I'll apply the map like instance everywhere. So I'll apply it here. And we can see that it's not actually mapping good, so we need to apply UV map. So, before the turbo smooth, we will do that. So, we will go here, change the poly select, apply the one, apply the two, 
apply the UV map already on the beta policy to gain change this to 2, it should be the same settings, so I will just apply the UV map and it should be fine. Now, again, poly select 3 UV map and this I will change to cylindrical, cap it, and I will try to press the fit and it should be fine. So now it's better, the, ma uh, the texture should fit, so I will drag this here, the U is there, it's I will fix this in a minute, so first of all I will go here, 